Okay, okay, so basically, in this video, what we will do, we will create one fish flag and we will deploy one application with the help of Big Fix Console. Okay. Okay. So for the same as I am here into the Big Fix Console. Okay. Mm -hmm. So from here we have to expand the bizarre tab, then all the bizarres, and mm -hmm. here we will get Windows Software Distribution Bizarre. Okay. So okay. So from here, what we have to do? We have to deploy one. There are there are multiple uh, options there like file pre cache. No, McPhee on demand scan wizard. So we can use these for a specific use, right? Yes. But right okay. now we are working on deploying the packages on Windows computers. Okay. Mm -hmm. So okay. the application which I have selected is 7 zip. So let me rename here. Okay. Mm -hmm. And just click on next. So now what we have to do, we have to select the package like where we have downloaded. Okay. So for the same look okay, at the path of the package. Path, yeah. So click browse and here it is the seven zip. Okay. So I have selected it. Simply click on next. Now these are the predefined platforms, like on all the platforms, that particular package will be suitable for installation. And okay. one more thing, uh, uh, which play, uh, in my lab, actually uh, uh, patches not downloading from the uh, from the internet. So anything we I need to do for that. Mm, okay, so after this, what we will do, uh, we will connect with your machine and we will troubleshoot it. Okay, but not right now. Okay, okay. So <coughs> Please keep as it is, okay, the default value because we do not require even 95, 98 ME and all those. It's not required actually, even though XP, on, uh, these are also not required. Yeah, but in some scenarios, some dependency should be there. So let it be whatever it is, okay. So simply, so default, we will proceed with the default one, right? Yeah, default one. Click on okay. that. <laughs> now, we do not want to target any relevant computer. We will select manually by OS or by the host name, okay. So okay. simply let it be again and click on that. So now this is the basic Ooh. commands. Actually, Big Fix console is quite intelligent. Like, you know, if you do not have any uh, knowledge for scripting, like as you can see, uh, here it uh, <laughs> here is the default script for silent Ooh. installation of application, correct? Ooh. So this is a default one, but if you want to modify, we can modify, but we will go with the default one. Just suppose if I have to install that software in this machine only. So what I will do, mm. I can simply uh, go to the root folder where I have downloaded it. It is on downloads or desktop downloads. Okay. Mm. So here, as you can see, 7 zip is already there. So this is a basic command line, like if you want to execute any MSI file silently, so this is the basic command that you can learn over the internet, multiple commands are there. So simply what I have to do. I know, I, I know DOS very well. Not an issue. Okay, so uh, this is just a demo, uh, demonstration, like if I have to manually install this application with command line, so what I have to type the same command, like I have to locate, hmm. this is the MSI, execute then we are going to install it silently and now we have to select the package correct and mm -hmm. then it will be a quiet installation q and and we can ignore this as well no restart because uh, winzip never asks for restart after installation okay but it has been there so not at least so so this is a simple thing. If I hit enter directly here, mm -hmm. that particular mm -hmm. application will automatically get installed in my big fix. Run and execute actually. Okay. In background. In background. So I do not want to install it in my server. So I'm closing mm -hmm. this for now. Okay. So this is the basic command actually. <laughs> mm -hmm. Simply click on next. So now <laughs> these are the uh, like parameters which we have selected. This is our source path. This is the name, mm -hmm. what we have given. And mm -hmm. this is a targeted platform, let it be. And this mm -hmm. is the command line. Means 
this particular fix let will execute this command okay when we deploy it okay so simply click on finish so now it has been created so this is the name for the fixlet that we have created okay the task yeah. we have created and that will be a name okay and now coming to the action part so this is a basic uh, script okay that it is mentioned here by default okay okay if you have some my uh, scripting knowledge you can modify it as per the requirement but right now we will go with the default one okay nothing to change here okay now in the relevance this is a kind of thing let it be default and these are just the name for the operating system which we have selected correct yeah the computers we have selected so nobody is here this is the property Actually, this is a parameter that if the os is equal equivalent to that then yeah then it then will it be will executed. deploy okay yeah so or uh, either we can select all the computer as well but for all the computers just suppose if you have linux mac os in your domain it will be applicable for all of them but it will never execute correct MS, msi not support the linux no? correct correct it will never execute okay so that is the reason why this is is and uh, that we have got th that thing here okay so coming okay. to the action plan here is the action here is the description that is fine now simply save the task so here it is our task is created now okay and mm -hmm. it will take some time to recognize the operating systems what we have in our in our domain okay so okay let's wait for it it may take one or two minutes only so now just try to click on action tab okay so as you can see here so far there is no applicable computer listed correct it will take some time again let's wait for it so means we cannot take action right now because we have no computers okay so what i can do here let's go back to fixlet and task refresh the console and let me search that thing 7j okay so <laughs> this is a manual thing that we have created this is not the default one which has been downloaded from big fix server oh. correct oh. So, that that was is highlighted right yes due to that is okay so let me now check okay now we are getting some computers here okay yeah so now it is a same thing like into the execution that is fine execution is fine into the users okay that is also fine message i can check this and i have to set deadline for one minute only okay because we do not have yeah. entire day to observe the thing okay so that is fine if you want to make some offer you can check that as well and uh, perfect so what we will do we will select windows 10 okay and okay we will push that fix that here so it has been in previous window a uh, pre pre previous version of big fix uh, there is a, a a different tool used for web reports right yes so now let me open big fix console here and we can check what we are getting here nothing so far okay we have got this as you can see yeah so yeah. let accept this also as you can so see i i will have to accept it yeah um, because we have uh, select uh, that option na to uh, make an offer that is the only reason and otherwise it will directly go to that screen only like you have deadline for 45 set set a uh, second mm -hmm. but we have configured over there okay so what okay so what user can do user can click uh, take action right now or here deadline for 30 seconds only so whatever is prior it will automatically install after that okay so let me click on take action here and let's wait huh completed so okay. you can check here as you can see here 7j page there okay yeah. 
so this is a simple thing and i will share recording for uh, that thing with you separately okay, okay. so i am okay. stopping the recording right now and we will connect for your troubleshooting part so let me stop the recording where it is